YouTube, man. Damn, man, phone blowing up off the hook. Can't even get no sleep. Another writing day, they trying to tell me, uh, true. Uh, they just tried to get Big Juke again over there in Red Creek. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just getting up, though, so. So enough, I turn on the news. Uh, he got one dead, one in custody. They say the motherfucker, the motherfucker knew each other. And, uh, I don't know, y'all. I'm just, uh, letting y'all know where my phone was, how I was woke up and shit. So, it's a developing story. Better walk over here and give me some goddamn chicken for breakfast. From the hood, though. And, uh, I don't know, Big Joe, give me out there, bro. It's getting close to home now. They in Red Crest. They in Red Crest now. So, uh, you know, Carmen is a bad motherfucker, though. So, I don't know. Long live Dolph. I don't need no more. This city is out of motherfucking control. Bro, here, bro, Red Crest right down the street, my nigga. And uh, they got them army veterans over there. I mean, Ridge Grove right down the street. They got them uh, them Navy SEALs over there in the Grove, though. So Grove ain't nothing to play with. They got them old heads over there in the Grove. And uh, see, back in the day, I remember the Grove versus Red Crest, Fraser. Grove ain't nothing to play with, though, so. It's just we don't need no more violence and shit, no more death and shit. But you know, we gonna let karma take its place. So, like I said. Okay, niggas say developing story. They just tried to get Big Juke and Ridgecrest. Man, the first thing came to my mind was like, the fuck Big Juke doing still hanging in Ridgecrest? You niggas got all this money, but I'm not, I don't know if it's true or false, man, but I'm just listening to you know, the way this shit put down, it seemed like like most hoods be having shit to where these niggas over here was getting into with these niggas for years and years and that shit go on and on. So a lot of time we be trying to figure out why this shit be happening. Sometimes this shit is it's so deep. Niggas probably forgot what happened, man, for real. But Grove Hero, if this is true and they just tried to get Big Jug because of what you said, Grove Hero, don't you feel like this shit might trickle back down to you eventually. So if you snitch or if you say something to get somebody else robbed, killed, or whatever, don't niggas realize that your turn coming next? Niggas don't realize his team going to feel like you felt about your nigga? When they nigga die, somebody going to feel like that about you? They going to come get this? Man, you niggas need to stop, man, for real. This shit corner is a stay for a corner, dog, man, for real.